Good day, this is Michelle. Today we would like to talk about what are the principles of HACCP. In our previous video, we have talked about the principle of HACCP. So what are they? There are a total of seven principles in HACCP, which are the steps that you will need to take in order to manage your food safety and also their risk in your food safety business. The seven principles are First, conduct a hazard analysis Second, identify the critical control point Third, establish a critical limit Fourth, monitor your critical limit Fifth, establish a corrective action Followed by establish a record keeping procedure And finally, establish a verification procedure Today, let's talk about principle 1 Conduct a hazard analysis the first step in any food safety plan or the HSCCP plan is to identify all possible hazards. First, you will need to consider all of the process in your organization. This might include first, receiving of your products, cooking of your materials, distribution of your materials, and also finally a waste disposal procedures. Once you have identified all of your processes in your organization, then you will need to identify what are the possible food hazards that can happen in all of your process. A food safety hazard can be anything that can cause contamination to your food or your product. Generally, there are a total of three types of contamination, which are biological, physical, and also chemical contamination. Once you have identified all of your potential hazards in all of your processes, then you will need to categorize them into biological, physical, and also chemical. If you like our video and find it informative, please like and share our video and we will see you in next episode.